Hey guys, Leslie here with another reaction video, this time to the <coughs> Flash, um, Season 3, Episode 8, called Invasion. Um, Supergirl ended yesterday with Barry and Cisco in Kara's apartment. And we're going to find out how she fits into this whole crossover episode. And Team Flash is dealing with the Dominators. And we'll probably see Team Arrow in this episode as well. So let's see what the hell is going to be going on in this episode. I'm excited about it. And if you guys have not subscribed, I hope that you guys do. Leave a thumbs up if you like this video. And also leave your comments in the box below. So without further ado, I will bring you the reaction to The Flash Invasion. Let's go. Not hard open. So, you know, I'll use your input. <laughs> right now, it's very important because the clock is ticking. My vision is set to include but oh, not limited damn, to HR. Bang, mm -hmm. a personal Harry. presentation tour well, of the system. Whatever or for Lincoln and Ben Hardy, have POW and a Cisco and Barry are not on talking terms. What a shocker. Particle vision. Particle vision. Particle vision, which is a moment to moment reenactment of the particle accelerator explosion. But and then they the want Wally not to use his powers. Who does that? Wally wants to use Listen, his powers. Listen, I know that you're trying to figure out how you add value to the team. I get it. But this. Let me stop you right there, VA. Okay, don't call me. I can make Star Labs the powerhouse in the scientific community <laughs> that it once was. Crazy. Crazy. I'm back. Oh, this is the crossover. But oh my god, the Dominators have a struck. Mary found them, and now the Dominators are going a little cuckoo, cuckoo, but you know, let's see how everything fits in together at the end of this episode. I'm so excited! Well, it's very aggressive. Mm. So, how long have you guys known about these Dominators? Mm -hmm. Since the 50s. That was them. Redmond, Oregon. The government tried to cover it up. What, I watched Psycho Jim? <laughs> in 1951, they appeared under the same sort of circumstances. The ship sure. crash landed, little to no communication. We learned they were abducting humans to gather intel about us. They attacked, That's and true. hundreds of soldiers lost their lives. Then, for some inexplicable reason, they left. They left, and now they appeared again. All contact again. had been lost until three months ago when the DOD received this. What is it? We pose no threat to human inhabitants. Understanding is our purpose. Any action against us. There you so go. So when we discovered four ships heading towards Earth, we were concerned that it was happening all over again. Everybody's going to have to get together with this. Obviously. Obviously. Got enough crazy going on. What are the chances this guy just decided that he had a plan? Here we go. No health insurance. Sick of the crazy hours. Barry is going to go there to talk with Oliver. <laughs> Came in the nick of time. Good. Lila, yeah, she came to where you getting the team together. I, uh, yeah, I uh I came to have you sign this before City Council went into mutiny, but that can totally wait. You're a bitch. For what? I thought you were tired. She's gonna be the bitch. Yeah, but it's it's aliens. Yeah. Oh, that is so cute. You guys just get home? together and go fight some aliens. Have you lost yeah, your yeah. mind? They're aliens. Oh my god, she does have a you. point. Not if we get Stein and, yeah. and all the others. They're calling themselves the Legends. Egotistical. Got team you Legends know tomorrow. I know where they were. Yep. Oh my god, that's how the last episode ended. Barry and Cisco showing up in Kara's apartment. Supergirl. They're gonna bring her back in that time warp thingy. Yep, I was right. That was cool. That was cool. Thanks for coming. Barry, I thought you were bringing an alien. And yeah, well, she is an alien. These are the dominators, apparently. Yep, here we go. Cool. Alright, well, I guess as a. This one, you gotta First get over it. You, is, uh, you have to get over it. Um, uh, Let's do a test run. Yeah, there you go. Test run. The um, whole team together. I get Supergirl. Alright? Test run against Supergirl. Oh, we just supposed to pretend like we don't hear him. So just uh, 
Straight up. Okay? Look alive. We're training to fight aliens by fighting an alien, so. Do it. Straight up. Stop. What? Good oh, job. Hey, what happened? What happened with Sart? He sacrificed himself. He saved us all. Oh, no, he did he not. Here. Oh, he, legend. Okay, legends of tomorrow. He probably died. Why? Damn, what are you doing snart. Here? You can't just show up and think you're gonna train with everyone else. Why not? Because we need to test you more. The HR Come said that my Wally. results were great. Wally, said, break. I'm good to go. I don't care. Total, there's no amount of feeling bad that could ever make up for that. Come on, really? You gotta get over it, dude. Like seriously, Barry, let it go. Before we start training, there's something you need. A message that would be better Damn. if we could share with you in private. All right, huh? step away. No, oh, no, it's fine. We can stay. All right, but no one else. All right. What's going on? Let's make it quick. Yeah. A war is coming, Captain Hunter. And at some point, you're going to be called back to Central City to fight it. So you need to know that while you and your team have been in the temporal zone, I've made a choice that affected the timeline. As you know, Whenever you alter the past, those changes affect the present and get compounded in the future. When you return, you will be in the new timeline I created where everyone's past and everyone's future has been affected, including yours. When you come back, don't trust anything or anyone, not even me. Where did you get that from? Damn. We found it in a secret room inside the Wave Rider. Damn. Until I realized that I made a big mistake and I tried to reset the timeline, put things back to how they were supposed to be, but Barry, you messed up the damn timeline, dude. Wow. Barry, so now everything is messed up. So what's changed since you did this? Cisco's brother is dead. Caitlin has powers. Dickel has a son now instead of a daughter. What? Mm -hmm. John had a daughter. Yep. I didn't just screw up my life, man. I screwed up everybody's lives, and apparently everybody's lives in the future. Mm -hmm. Felt like when these aliens got here that finally something would happen. I didn't cause it. Maybe I could make up for anything I've done to everybody, but I, I think we should build up with everybody. You gotta tell me. Training time with Supergirl, really? So this is what? Like, let's get going to the story, guys. The Dominators have yet to engage in an act of questions. Blah, blah, blah. What does Argus think? Oh, no. Did the president just get hurt? Are you serious? Or did he disappear and they took him? Traveler has been taken. I repeat, Traveler has been taken. The Dominators have the president. Yep, there you go. Okay. Be able to if I don't know how to use my powers. Please, I want to help you the same as you do. So show me how. There you go. Someone's got to show Wally the damn ropes, okay? Yeah. Ah, uh, no. Thank you for joining me, my dear. Of course, I, I was am. Much help back then. Apparently, you had a daughter. Very messed up the damn daughter. timeline. Baby John was babysitter. Oh, damn. Very so when it messed up everyone's future. Right, you just, uh, you just erased a daughter from my life. You can't go back. Oh my god, I hope they don't freaking get swarmed on. This would be something. How do you want? Jiggy. 
Oh, come on, man. Are you serious? They need to stop getting brainwashed. <laughs> Oh my god, no. Oh my god, here we go. Oh, damn. Three superheroes. Holy shit. Go, Wally. Be kid flash. That's right, buddy. Where's the flash? Where's the flash? Wally? Kid flash. <laughs> oh, no, Supergirl! Shit. Damn it. What is he doing? Oh, my God, what the hell is he doing? But he knows Supergirl is invincible. Maybe that's the point. Oh, come on, get this mind control shit down. Come on, Wally, get up. Oh, no, no more arrows. There you go. Knock some sense into her. Good job, guys. Your potential. I do. One of my many gifts. Are you gonna train him? You wanna train? That's why train you. somebody gotta do it. Somebody gotta do it. So is it like being on mind control and stuff? I didn't realize he had a mind to be controlled. <laughs> Barry, about before? Message or no message? We're with you. Thank you. There you go. Scanning the city to make sure there aren't any more of the orbs that are waving at all of you. Okay? So now what? What now? Oh, Lila. Kick so ass. These dominators aren't here peacefully. Mm -hmm. <gasps> no! They took them like Kim Harry. Go. Shit. 
Well, that was it, guys. This was a crazy reaction. But the story will continue tomorrow on Arrow. We'll find out where the hell our superheroes have gone. What the Dominator's plan is moving forward. How Barry's going to save the freaking superheroes of the world. But this was a good episode. So remember, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and comment down below. And tell me what you think of tonight's crossover episode. Until later. Bye, guys.